Yo, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video here. Today we're gonna be playing on PvP Cloud, which is a new server that just released a few days ago. And I'm honestly very excited for this series because it is a ton of fun. And this is the start of the world because the server didn't start that long ago. And we're gonna be opening some crates and just checking out the server and our farms and stuff. So let's get straight into it. We do have some clouds, which is the currency on the server. So let's go ahead into the cloud shop. We can go ahead into the loot boxes and buy three of the summer loot boxes. Boom, confirm. And so let's go back to the island to actually open it. We do have some spawners and some farms set up that I'm going to showcase a little bit later. So let's just go. So let's just see what we get, get from these crates. Actually, we could get money, coins, another loot box, some clouds. So you could get some pretty good stuff. So boom, let's just put the first one down and see what we get. Let me activate fly real quick. And hopefully we can get something good to help us in our island. And let's see. It looks like we're going to get some gas spawners maybe. Uh, let's just see when it goes into our inventory. And we got five gas spawners, pet boxes, and that's it. Probably some money. Yeah, we got some money and mob coins and tokens and all that good stuff. But if we're going to take that, we do actually have a quite amount of tokens we have 78 billion we're currently working on leveling up our hoe so boom open up the next crate let's see if we can get anything good and it looks like we got 10 more gas spawners which we'll take we got some phantom keys we'll open up those two i guess and this is the last one hopefully we can get something good in this one we did get five crystal hoe levels we're actually gonna take that we do need to get to level 50 in order to unlock the carrots because we currently don't have a potato farm which you need level 25 for we're definitely gonna take those from the crates if you guys are looking to buy anything from the store make sure to use the creator code like at the checkout for 10% off of your purchase. There's so many things on the store that you can buy. There's ranks, clouds, and loot boxes, and all that good stuff. So, yeah, make sure to use the creator code Wyclo. But now let's go ahead and showcase the island. If we go ahead and these are our basic farms for now, I don't think we're going for spawners too, too much. But we have 36 IGs right there. And over here is just like our regular spawners, like sheeps and stuff. And basically, what you do is you just stay here with your sword. If you want to activate it, you just click your uh, you just click your hoe and put the sword on. And you could go here and start farming. And you could get tokens and all that good stuff. There's a bunch of enchants, but we are currently focus on the farming aspect we do have a hoda is level 39 and these are our current farms we have this carrot farm over here down here we have the wheat and the nether wart you start off on the wheat that is the basic one and then it goes to the potatoes carrots and another wart i'm pretty sure the sugar cane too but i forgot what level that is at and we have been grinding a bit so yeah we are level 39 with the hoe and i think we really just want to get to level 50 for the carrots um we have been grinding a bit so yeah we don't have a potato farm currently which you could actually start farming at level 25 and i don't really feel like building one so we're just going to be continuing to farm wheat for now and we also did get some other stuff from some previous loot boxes but let's just check out so we got an ultimate cell one which is a 2x multiplier and that is going to be really really good for the uh spawners and we got some goliath rain kits which are going to be good because i'm pretty st sure there is pvp and we have a bunch of these spawners that we should probably place down so i'll probably do that a little bit later okay so we got to level four down the hill i think i'm going to stop farming for now but i do want to showcase off our pets we do have a ultimate a tool pet here which gives us some more tool experience to help level it up faster and we do also have the set equip which is the token set if you do slash sets i'm pretty sure yeah sets there's the money set token set skill set and experience set and we're using the token set just from our tokens um i think it's the best one for us now we do need a lot of tokens to upgrade our hoe we currently have it maxed out all the enchants we have token greed is probably the most important one i think at level 45 yeah at level 45 is when we can actually unlock the next enchant but i don't even think it's a good enchant i think it's just for some extra money and i don't even know how good it is we're definitely gonna have to ask some of my island members because they have been grinding a ton and i'm pretty sure they probably have over level 50 and if you guys are new and don't currently have a farm if you do slash warp barn there's actually automatically crops here for you there's wheat um i'm pretty sure there's carrots and potatoes too um, if you go over here, there's the potatoes there and there and over there are the carrots So yeah, if you don't have your own farm, you could come here and farm There shouldn't be too many people there I'm pretty sure everybody kind of has their own farms already But if you are new, you can go ahead and farm here Later on, maybe in a future episode, I do want to go ahead and start grinding out the sword I'm pretty sure the sword is pretty, I think it's easier to level up I'm pretty sure people have like level 90 swords and stuff. But as you see, these swords and hoes actually have these custom textures, which are actually kind of cool. But I just forgot we did get those 10 phantom crates that I do want to go ahead and open. So if we go to slash crates, let's just open all of them up. And it looks like we got some money, some tokens, got some mob coins, and we got three pay spawners. So, okay, so those were kind of mid. Uh, we didn't really get to anything too good, but they are just phantom crates. So you can't expect much out of them. We'll definitely take anything that we do get just for a little bit of help. And if we take a look at Ice Top, we are currently Ice Top 9, which is not that good. We honestly want to beat Dazzer. I'm on Gucci Dix Island, and he is one of the owners on the server. If we take a look, we have uh 36 igs and 30 or 91 gas so we can definitely be doing better we don't have too many spawners yet but we are probably going to start grinding a ton more as an island just so we could try to win there's also these stash events in chats which are basically just envoys where 
chest one pvp and drop some good rewards if you guys if you guys do like pvp then that is pretty good there's also the dark zone but i'm pretty sure we're gonna probably go over that later it's basically a uh, zone with mobs and there's his own shop and everything but i think we're just focused on farming and getting our hoe leveled up and i just checked in our crates but we actually have almost 1000 of these farmer crates which you can actually get from this key magnet enchant so let's just go ahead and open up all those quickly we should get some pet boxes and all that good stuff and we got let's see 20 common pet boxes 27 rare and 64 common so that's like 84 common pet boxes and 53 boosters we're definitely gonna take the boosters the boosters actually help a lot when trying to level up the omni tool we honestly have so many pet boxes it's gonna take me a while to actually sort them out so i think i'm gonna do that later yeah but i'm pretty sure i've covered everything for the start of the world basically we're just focusing on farming and getting our hoe leveled up and then we're probably gonna go and start leveling up our sword and all that good stuff we're just trying to make a lot of money um we don't have that many spawners yet so we're definitely gonna have to get more if we do want more money and more island value because we currently are trying to get to the ice top place and we're only ice top nine and our actually main goal is to beat dazzler which is ice top four and that's about eight billion more uh island value than we have but yeah i think i'm gonna wrap things up there if you guys did enjoy make sure to use code byclo for 10 percent off of any purchase but that's gonna be it see you in the next one peace out